Hey y'all. As you guys can see from the title, we are doing a haul video today, but if it's your first time seeing me, hi, my name is Lisa. I make fashion, travel, and lifestyle related content. And today we are collaborating with Dressin.com. I've received a pretty large package here, y'all. I'm not gonna lie, there's a couple pieces in here, spring related clothing, but also just like everyday clothing, like basics and stuff like that. So I picked out a couple items. Thank you, Dressin, for sending me these clothes. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, it's not giving first impression. If you know me, I always open the package up. One thing about me is I'm not going to wait. But I am still gonna show y'all what I got and um, give you my honest opinion. So let's get right on into it. First, I have these jeans. Everything will be linked in the description in the order in which I'm showing them in case you guys are interested, but just a pair of mom jeans here. I think these ones are supposed to be kind of like low rise or like mid rise, so let's try this on. First up, we got the jeans, okay? Honestly, this fits a lot better than I expected. I'm not gonna lie. Dressin.com is like an Asian style site, so sometimes the sizing, I'm scared. But this one is a hit. We're starting off strong. We are starting off strong. They actually kind of flare out at the bottom. Like, can we see that? Can we see that? But yeah, this is a really good jean. I'm not even gonna lie. Like, the wash is cute. The fit is cute. I'm not really into the super, super high rise these days. So, like, this is actually something I would wear. Like, this fit right here. Yup. Yeah, but I do like these. It's kind of like a softer jean material. It's not like jegging. That was a bad phase and we should not bring that back. But like, it's definitely not like super, super hard denim. So it's like comfortable to actually wear. Okay, next we have another pair of pants that are brown. They're kind of like work pants, but like y'all know how that's a thing. Like that's a style. So I picked these out with a vision in mind. But let's put this on and see if it's, if it's giving what I hope it is. All right, come on, corporate betty. <laughs> hey, it is giving corporate betty. Like, <laughs> now I'm not gonna lie, these pants kind of eat. I'm not gonna lie. I got a little mirror over here, so like, I'm kind of checking. But I really, really like this actually. Okay, yeah, guys, these pants are cute. This fits well as well. Like, I feel like it wants to be high rise, but I don't want that for me. The way that the waist is, like it kind of like cinches in more so it's high rise, but I can kind of like pull it lower and make it low rise. And you know how sometimes like people wear like the business stuff, but they like make it kind of streetwear with like some sneakers or like a fitted hat, like, yeah, stop playing. Stop playing with me. Okay, almost forgot I had another pair of mom jeans that I got. These ones honestly are like similar in wash, but they're actually high rise. Let's just try this on, let me show y'all how this is fitting. My dog looking at me like, girl. And I'm looking back at her like, girl. Anyways, these jeans aren't as bad as I thought. I will say like in person, the wash is not my favorite. Like, I don't know, compared to this one, I feel like this one looks a little bit more acid wash. So it looks like it has more of that vintage feel, but this one's kind of like one toned. I don't know this isn't bad though like for a high rise i thought i'd hate her more but i don't know i'm kind of feeling her right now with the hair and the makeup and the shirt and just, yeah i'm kind of feeling it just a little bit i sticked with my usual sizing by the way guys i didn't size up i didn't size down so i stick to what i usually stuck to or what i usually stick to okay another pair of pants i like have a really sick problem with cargo right now like everything cargo like i'm really looking at it and feeling like i need it so I picked this up. Um, these ones kind of have like a dressy vibe a little bit. Like, okay, this bang in my eye will be the downfall of this video. So this one's kind of have like a bit of a dressy vibe. It has this two button action right here. I'm not typically a fan of that. It gives 2014 badly, but um, we'll just see how this looks, honestly. Besides that, I think it looks good, but let's try this on. Okay, a couple things to say. For a two button pant, this is actually not as hideous as I thought, and I think it's because of the fit of it. Um, the fit is nice, like it's a really nice like wide leg. It's like, it just looks good, but it's a little, it's a little tight. I'm folding over just a little bit. Yeah, same size in this as the other ones, but the waist, like they're trying to snatch me in and I appreciate it, but like, relax a little bit, <laughs> relax. Maybe this, maybe for these pants, I would size up. I will say that. 
I think this just kind of feels like it's the wrong size a little bit. Next thing I have to show you guys actually is, you guessed it, a set. If y'all know me, like I love a set so bad, like almost as much as I love a cargo jean. So I was kind of trying something different here. Like I was envisioning like a 90s kind of vibe here with this set. So it's like this brown, like pants and shirt set and it just like buttons down and it gives like an oversized vibe. Like, I don't know, I was picturing something. <laughs> I be trying to experiment, like who asked me to do that? Yeah, let's try this on, let's see how this looks on. Honestly, this is kind of eaten. Like, like I said, like this isn't like my usual style, I feel like, but I'm kind of liking what I'm seeing right now. Like, I will say the pants, like, I feel like they want it to be like, th like who's doing this? No, why would I do that? <laughs> I'm not gonna wear it like that. So I think like as a kind of mid waist, low waist type ting, it looks really good. This gives like, I'm gonna go run an errand, but like, I'm not trying too hard. And even as individual pieces, like this is a look by itself with the pants. And this is definitely a nice layering top. Now that was actually everything pants related. Next, I actually want to show y'all this simple top that I got. So I have this little off the shoulder top. Honestly, I don't really have like a loose chill off the shoulder top. I wanted to have something just like something like a basic like this. So let's try this on. Here is the top. This is honestly just like real simple, real chill. Um, I do like this. I think it's a good basic to have. This material is actually pretty good. Like it's really soft. I'm not gonna lie. It's honestly a bit long length. Like, Stop playing before I wear it as a dress. But okay, y'all, this is the shirt. I got one more other basic because why not? This one is honestly just like a long sleeve basic. It's kind of like a mid-length long sleeve top. So let me try this on for y'all. I am trying these on with one of my jeans and this is definitely like a simple fit I would wear. Like don't sleep on the basics. Once I accessorize this, like it's a look. I hope it's not see-through on this camera. I really don't know. I really don't know because it is thin. It's not like a thick long sleeve shirt, but nonetheless, I like this. I think it's pretty good. But yeah, I won't stay on this one too long because it's literally just a black, it's just a black, <laughs> it's just a black shirt. Like there's not much to talk about here. Okay, y'all, the next thing I have, I feel like I just kind of wanted like a white crew neck because I don't really have one or I don't really have too many. So I wanted this, but like, lol. Anyways, let me just put this on so y'all can see. Matter of fact, I'll just put this over the the black um shirt right now okay day to day let's keep it a buck <laughs> day to day i'm not styling a fit with this but i will say this is probably the softer sweater i own like inside is literally like this soft fleece material like it's super light so it's not like a heavyweight sweater but it's definitely very comfortable i was contemplating maybe even cropping it but i crop everything so i'm like Maybe just leave this one alone. Maybe just leave this one alone. But let me know what y'all think, honestly. Like, should I crop this or should I leave it a normal length? Now, I have strategically saved the best for last this dress. <laughs> now, I know it's literally just a simple gray dress, but like, it'd be these kinds of things. That'd be my favorite. Like, it just has this nice ribbed material. It's super, super stretchy. And it's just this light gray color perfect for the summertime as it's coming up so let me just show y'all i'm super excited about this one no because look at the look at the material look at the material i need a cookout to go to i need a summer vibe to go to i need an errand to run i need to go somewhere immediately um i can't get enough of a maxi dress like i'm actually obsessed like it's really really bad and sometimes with maxi dresses like i find them very uncomfortable to like move and maneuver in but like this one is stretchy enough like the stretch of it is just as good as the skims one so honestly a really 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 good dress you guys will be seeing this one a whole lot definitely my favorite item in the whole haul but y'all that's actually it for the video thank you so much for watching if you guys are interested like i said all the links are in the description please comment down below though your favorite item let me know what i should be wearing next and i will see you guys in my next one bye